हेलो स्टूडेंट्स टुडे वी विल डू द प्रैक्टिकल ऑफ सेकंड चैप्टर दैट इज फंक्शनिंग ऑफ अ कंप्यूटर अ कंप्यूटर इज अ इलेक्ट्रॉनिक मशीन ओके इट इज एन इलेक्ट्रॉनिक मशीन इट एक्सेप्ट द डेटा फ्रॉम यूजर टू परफॉर्म सर्टेन ऑपरेशंस एंड प्रोवाइड द रिजल्ट एज द रिजल्टफुल इंफॉर्मेशन सो इन शॉर्ट अ कंप्यूटर वर्क्स इन द फॉलोइंग मैनर लाइक इनपुट प्रोसेस एंड देन आउटपुट सो इन दिस चैप्टर we will learn the tasks that are performed on the computer with the help of hardware and the software so students do you know what are the computer hardware yes that you can see and touch are called hardware so this computer hardware are classified into various ways like input devices processing device output devices and storage devices so first of all i we will learn input devices so what are the input devices you can see here this is a keyboard this is also a input devices it has many keys on it like alphabet keys a to z you can see alphabet keys that is from a to z numbers key you can see here numbers key from 0 to 9 and some other special keys okay like enter you can see enter backspace caps lock arrow keys etc these keys are used by the computer users for typing the text on the computer so a standard keyboard has 104 keys on it so now the other input devices is what that is mouse you can see here mouse a mouse is also known as a pointing device it has two buttons like left button and right button and scroll wheel okay by using mouse you can point you can you can point okay you can click you can click you can double click okay you can right click drag scroll anything okay so so we are also having some examples of input devices like joystick scanner touchpad microphone all that are input devices now now what are the processing devices do you know yes the processing device takes place in the cpu that is central processing unit and the cpu is placed inside the system cabinet so this is a system cabinet where a cpu is placed and the cpu consists of the following component that is alu cu and mu okay now what are the output devices okay what are the output devices yes it is used to drive outputs of the work that we do on the computer okay you can see here this is monitor and it is also known as a visual display unit it displays the work that we do on the computer the output of this display is called a soft copy so here you can see this is the output devices that is a monitor okay speakers printers plotters that all are output devices so now computer software what are the computer software as we have discussed about the computer hardware so now what are the computer software so the set of instruction given to the computer is called program and the collection of the program is called software so software has divided into various parts okay first is system software and the other is application software so like uh, operating system windows 7 windows 8 are the best example okay this all are, in this system we have uh, windows 7 so it is a system software and on the other side the application software so am uh, application software are what application software is installed on the computer to perform a specific task like ms word see here this is your application software ms word okay notepad paint that all are the example of application software okay we can do paint this is a application program okay this is a application software you can paint anything in this software program okay so these all are the example of software okay so with the help of software and hardware you can do various tasks in your computer okay so this is how a uh, computer works using hardware and software okay